Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. We've been selling auto parts for over 30 years. We removed the hood so that it's easier to see on camera, but you don't have to do this to do this job. Okay, so before we take the wires off, you can see on the distributor cap, the numbers are marked for which wire is which. There's number one, there's number two, number three, number four, number five, and number six. So, I'm just gonna make sure. So before I do that, I'm gonna mark this one as number one. This next one right here is number three. And then this one right here is number five. And then this one right here is number two. This one says number four. And this last one should be number six. It says number six. All right, so I'm gonna start with pulling off number one. Sometimes these can be tricky. And there's a little retainer right here, and I'm gonna pop it out so I get a little more slack in the wire and I can twist it back and forth and generally you should be able to pull it up. Okay. And over on the spark plug we'll do the same. Just twist the wire and gently pull it up. So before we start installing the wires, what we wanna do is take all the wires out of the box and set them in order from smallest to longest. And at that point, what you can do is one at a time, when you pull a wire out, you can bring it over and match it up to the length. And then you know that's the correct wire for that. We can label this as number one or we can just install it and go to the next one. So we have our number one spark plug wire. We're gonna fish it through here. Underneath this wire and down and right onto the spark plug down here. And it should lock in place. And then here we're gonna put it on the number one slot in the distributor cap. And push that down in place. And then there's a wire retainer right here. I'm just gonna push it down right there. And make sure the wires aren't touching anything else or rubbing on any metal that they could rub and arc out. And that one looks good. So we're gonna do the number two plug wire. And pull this one off. Right there. And there was a retainer holding it right there. So just pull that off. And then right here, I'm just gonna pull and wiggle it back and forth. And it's got a long boot that goes all the way down underneath the intake. You don't have to take the intake off to do these though. Just like that. So again, we'll line up these to figure out which size is which. This one's the smaller one with the long boot on it. So this is our number two plug wire. So here's our number two wire. We're gonna slide this down in there. Make sure you get it on the spark plug first. Once it's on the spark plug, 
push it down and this little grommet goes over this retainer. That just guides it in and then it locks in. And there's a little holder that holds the plug wire. And then we'll root it over to here. And that's gonna go on number two. And push it down. So the odd numbers are gonna be on this side. So one, three, five. And then the even numbers are on this side. This is two, four, six in the back. Last one back here is a little bit tough. Get your hands in back there. Just twist it a little bit. Try to pull while you're twisting. Oh. Pull that one out. Okay, now we'll install this number six wire. It's hard to line this up, but Send this back here. This is really hard to see, so you have to do it by touch. Or if you had a mirror, a mirror might help. But just feel around, try to find the spark plug. So we got that on. Make sure you push it down so it's all the way down. We'll line this up here. I'm gonna snap this in first. This is number six, and then we will push this into the clips that hold the wire on, like that. Okay, so we're gonna do, next we're gonna do number three and number five. We did these difficult ones already. These two are gonna be the same. These are a lot easier to get to. This is number three, and this one's number five. Thanks for watching. Visit us at 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts, fast and free shipping, and the best customer service in the industry.